Okay, fifth graders. So we're going over um, what I want you to do over your little Thanksgiving break here. This is page 215. We're starting the chapter five reteaching. And uh, yeah, you can tell whose book I, uh, I opted to use here. I pulled a stick. And look at that, a little heart. Look at little heart, how sweet. Jalissa was here. So I don't know. She raised two class points, thank you. So I don't know who, um, who did that, but uh, very sweet, very sweet. All right, anyways, uh, getting on with the work here. Um, mental math, so I'm just gonna do, um, I'll do the second one here. Some of these problems, when you guys look at them, you can just do them in your head. You don't actually have to break out, you know, a piece of scratch paper or a sticky note and do the math, you know, on pen to uh, pen to paper. I'm looking at number two here. Uh, I'm just going to eliminate that zero and eliminate that zero. So what do I have? I have now 27 being divided by nine. All right. So you should know that is three. There's your answer. So remember. We eliminate zeros if they're all crossed out whatever answer you have is the correct answer if there was a zero left over then we would add a zero to our answer so there's number two done for you number um, set B here number one I'm not gonna have you guys do these so I'll just put a line through those and a line through those three but I am gonna do number one I want you to look at this. It does say estimate. So um, if I was to estimate this, I would probably change this to 160 and I would just change this to 40. Because when you estimate, it's important that you use, as they say, compatible numbers. Well, 16 and four, those are compatible numbers because I know that four goes into 16 four times. And so in this particular problem here, um, I know that, let's see here, where is this? Making sure I'm looking at the right spot here. Um, I can cross out the two zeros and four goes into 16 four times and that would be my answer. All right, so you don't have to do the, uh, in set B, you don't have to do any of that. Let's go down to the bottom of the page here. I'm looking at set C now. And it says uh, use a model to find each one. Just cross that out. That's, that's, uh, I'm not worried about models. But again, some of these you can just do in your head. And I'm going to look at number one, for example, here. So this is 180 and it's being divided by 15. So, I know that 15 goes into 18 once. What's left over? Three. What do I bring down that I haven't used? The zero. What's a three and then a zero? That's 30. How many times does 15 go into 30? Twice. The answer is 12. So, if you didn't follow me with that, watch. 15 from 18. There's three left over. I bring down the zero. 15 goes into 30 twice. The answer is 12. So some of these you can just do in your head. Okay? And that was an example of just doing one in your head. All right? Um, next page. We're looking at set D now. Set D. Okay, um, go ahead and you can just um, divide these. I mean, you could cross out the zeros and figure out how many times 33 goes into 57. Um, it wouldn't be too hard. But some of these you could at least partially do mentally. But um, go ahead and do set D. Now set E, 
move my coffee here. Set E, I was actually going to do it differently and I set it up with my other class and I realized it wouldn't work. So, um, <clears throat> again, I'll just look at the first one with you guys here. I can cross out the zeros. And so now we have a uh, two that's going into what? 42. Well, anytime you divide a number by two, you're really just cutting it in half. So what's half of 42? 21. 21. So the answer would be 21. Okay. So, and then yes, I want you to do number nine. Somebody asked me about that. So, so that's your homework for uh, tonight or over the break. So it's just pages 215 and 216. Do pages 215 and 216. Don't do, what was it? Yeah, set, it was set B. Yeah, set B, the estimating one. That's the one I was saying you don't have to do. Don't do set B. Okay? All right. Very short video. I hope you guys enjoy your Thanksgiving break. All right. Everybody repeat after me. Okay. Shh. Mom. Mom. Oh, that was terrible. Say it again. Mom. Mom. I love you. I love you. I hope. You have, you have lots of turkey. Lots of turkey.